So one of the things you kind of have to deal with if you are a Mainer is you bring your car to the shop every year to get it inspected. That could be changing. New Center Mainer's Sean Stackhouse joining us live now this morning with more on this topic. Hey, Sean. Lee, good morning. Well, today the state's uh, legis the state legislature's committee on transportation is set to review a bill that looks to eliminate state vehicle inspections for the majority of cars here in the state. It's one of just a number of bills going before the transportation committee today that looks to change the state's vehicle inspection policy. Now, the bill that would eliminate those inspections altogether is proposed by Senator Dave Miermont of Knox. Miermont says having a required yearly inspection doesn't help make main roads any safer. He adds that too often mechanics find something in need of repairs as the $12.50 inspection fee doesn't cover the cost of their time. According to Miramon, more than two thirds of states have already changed their vehicle their vehicle inspection policy, no longer requiring yearly inspections. He adds that those inspections can often make drivers complacent, putting off important repairs until it is inspection time. Miramon says he has a commercial vehicle license and if everyday drivers took the same precautions he does, the roads would be much safer than they are just relying on the sticker. We're required to do a walk around on the vehicle. We're required to turn the lights on and take a look. Do they work? When people take that level of responsibility for their vehicle, we're going to have a lot less problems, a lot less than we have with an inspection program. And there is opposition to this bill. A representative from the Bureau of Motor Vehicles testified about concerns that without an inspection sticker, used car buyers wouldn't know what they're buying is safe to drive. And the commanding officer of the State Police Traffic Safety Unit raised questions about who would be responsible for ensuring vehicles are actually repaired properly. The state's Transportation Committee will be reviewing this bill at 1 p.m. today. Live in Augusta this morning, Sean Stackhouse, New Center, Maine.